This battle broadcast is brought to you by Mr. Magic Down Under and DiceRemoval.com. This is round two of Standard Illumination. And I lost the die roll. Now this hand is pretty bad, but I'm gonna keep it anyway. Because I have four land sources and there's a small chance I might draw favorably. Oh dear. Is he mono green? That'll be pretty bad. Oh. Shock. Shock seems to be pretty good right now. Alright, I'll go with the shock. Okay. Chain rocks is a good draw. I imagine that these um that these Wally Helix is gonna come in handy. Green wise. Alright. He may flash something in, so... <sighs> I'm so greedy, I'm gonna take this card. Mainly because I wanna start using my tokens and summon later. I had no idea he had one of the Sato. That's kind of annoying. Do I use chains here or well, I swear I use Bully Helix? Yeah, I probably won't even block either. Actually, no, I had 4 damage is quite a lot. I should probably take off Garak now. Oh, this still can. Perhaps swinging at um. Oh, that's in this play. Perhaps swing both my tokens out. Garak was a mistake because I knew he was gonna block my um tokens anyway. Ah, oh, that's annoying. So many elves. At this point, probably not. There's so many building cards. Mortar. Gosh darn it.
Okay, I do want chain of rocks. I forgot, he's blocked the wall. That was silly sleeve me. Until I deal with his, um... Oh no, he did have a flash creature. Well, oh, there goes my ability to hit the ground now. I need to talk like a phoenix and end the game like that. I have advantage because he's going to be dealing the entire time. He has so much dealing cards. The deal is so bad. I might even consider playing um, um, Epilons for here. Like everything is like free to cast, to cast. So much land on both ends. Oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, he drew more lands than I did. Just by one. There's some lag on my end, I'm not sure why. Garak. Oh, yeah, 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 fair enough. It's gonna be a pretty big creature. Hitting chain rocks would be nice. Using them earlier on the um, one jobs was probably a bad idea. Oh, the lag is so bad. Hopefully, doesn't pop deck um, a Johnny or something and basically double strike me to death. That'd be painful. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 
One second, I need- I'll be right back off this. Yep, GG, alright. Be right back. Okay, I'm back now. Um, it turns out he's playing a um, ramp deck into walkers, and he kills me by basically hitting me with big white creatures. So I need to find a way to end the match really quickly. So I'll cut out the um, shocks. Don't really care about his delving creatures. I bring in reprisals, two additional mortars, and faded. I can bring in um, Banishing Lights or um, Rebels because he can't really deal with them. Actually, that would end the game much quicker. But then it will defeat the person trying to stay alive. Difficult, difficult, difficult. Actually, I'm, I'll give it a shot. As far as I can tell, our green white does not have many, many ways of killing my creatures. This should be the better play. Here we go. Not much removal spells, nothing along the lines. All he does is just diddle the entire game until he draws his um, big creatures to kill me. Or his walkers, of course. How do I beat him? Well, I basically make sure I kill his big creatures. incapacitate them and just kill him quickly although that last game game one it wasn't like that I just basically grinded them out because he only drew one threat the entire game the rest was just diddle you know considering I did not bought out my um burn spells probably playing the um the um, fire dances might have been a better call. Yeah, actually, that was a really silly sideboard plan. Oh well. I consider this to be a decent hand. I highly doubt the mutable will go in, so I'll open with the um, temple so I could use the um, early Boris Charm. Then again, do I really need to use the early Boris Charm? Probably not. I could go mutable, gamble it, maybe I can swing in. If I can't swing in, I can't swing in. I can deal with his um, turn 3, or turn 2. Spell? Yeah, it's not happening. I'll go with the temple. Gives me more options. <sighs> Do I? I haven't seen enough of his deck yet. I can't really determine if that's the right choice. Yeah, I'll do it. Okay. Since I have it, I'll go for it. Kinda wish it was a dancer though. If it was a dancer, that would've been great. Do nothing. Do nothing. Just swing at me. And so it begins.
if this was down to though, this would be so much different. Probably gonna flash in the creature now. Nope, nothing. Walker. Six to cast, what is this? Burning tree, I'm simmering. Okay, sure. Ah! Yeah, that's pretty bad. land. Okay. Mats, 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 mats. Um, damage, 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 damage. He's dead next turn. I see the block then. If he flashes in the creature, <coughs> if I stop two creatures, one, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, I live. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, eight, I live. Skullcrack and Skullcrack. GG.